Uh, welcome back. Now uh, you read the problem, you think about it, you try to solve it by yourself, and you come back. So, what it says is uh, you are in Mars, a planet, a different planet than the Earth, where the acceleration A is 0 0.379 g of the g is the acceleration of the earth 10 meters per second squared so will produce an acceleration so the acceleration in mars is 3.79 meters per second squared so it say that the time to come back when you launch something the time to come back is 8.5 seconds 8.5 seconds means that the time to go up is 4.25 seconds. So what it's asking you is, don't, don't read what it's asking you. Write the equation of motion. The equation of motion is V of D is an equation of motion with constant acceleration. It will be V of D equal V0 plus AT, Y of D equal Y0 plus V0 T plus 1 half AT squared. So we plug in the numbers for this particular case where the acceleration is minus 3.79. And here is V0 AT minus... Sorry, I made a mistake. 3.79 divided by 2. So you have to correct the mistake. 3.79 divided by 2. So once that you wrote the equation, you read the problem. So the equation says that V of t is V0 minus 3.79t. And Y of t equal Y0, but you launch from the floor. So Y0 equal 0 plus V0t. These are the two equations. So the first thing that I'm going to try to do is when the time t is 4.25, uh, the final velocity is zero. So this will allow me to find the time to go to up to the maximum height. So if I do it, I will find that the maximum height is V0 equals 16.10 meter per second. Perfect. Now, if I take the second equation and I plug in Y at this time, I will find V0, 16.10, V0, by T, the time elapsed, 4.27, minus 3.79 divided by 2. 3.79 divided by 2 is, uh, let me do it, uh, 3.79 divided by 2 is 1.9. 1.9, approximately 1.9. So this is 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 1.9, 
So read this problem, try to do it by yourself, and come back. So th this is an interesting problem that uh, you should pay attention to know how to solve it because it, it involves the manipulation of the equation in, in, in a very, very nice way. So the idea is like this. You are at the Earth and you launch something from the floor, from y0 equals 0. You launch something, an object, with velocity v0. We know, and we did in class, that the object will decrease its velocity because the acceleration is minus 10 meter per second squared. The object will go with the velocity decreasing, decreasing because the acceleration is negative. It's producing a change in the velocity. The acceleration is a change in velocity, so it produces minus a change in velocity of minus 10 meter per second every second. So the velocity will. So what will be the equation for constant acceleration? The equation for constant acceleration is that v final equal v0 plus a t and y final equal y0 plus v0 t plus one half t square. We write this equation for this particular case. Um, what we want to do is uh, it say uh, if the if the if the object arrived 12 meters up from the floor 12 meters and you do the same thing you do the with this acceleration in the earth and you launch again the the object on the moon with the same velocity uh, what will happen what are the differences and the differences are that the equation will behave different because the acceleration will be different instead of minus 10 the acceleration will be 1.7 meters per second square because the acceleration is say 0 0.17 g and g is 10 so it will be 1.7 of course the acceleration is negative it's negative according to how we took the system of reference so for this uh, experiment when we launch with velocity v0 and arrive to the point 12 meters what is the initial velocity okay we solve it v final equal v initial minus acceleration t 10 by t when the velocity final is zero the time t is v0 divided by, by 10 so we don't know t and we don't know v0 but we know the relation between t and v0 i will plug in this t into the equation of y what is the equation for y y0 zero is zero so it will be and y will be 10 12 so the equation this equation will be 12 equal v0 that i don't know by t but the time t is this amount is v0 divided by, by 10 so i will plug in v0 divided by, by 10 is t of t so v0 multiplied by t well, let's go to write the equation minus 5 t squared so 12 equal v0 by t v0 divided by, by 10 minus 5 by t squared t squared is v0 squared divided by 100 okay so i have this equation so what i have to so no, do now is to solve for v0 if you do it you will find it's here it's done it's here it's here it's here it's here it's done here that the velocity the initial velocity is 15.5 meter per second so the time elapsed for the object to go to the maximum height in this case t is v0 divided by, by 10 by the acceleration so is 15.5 divided by 10 so the time elapsed to go to the maximum head is 1.5 seconds perfect now we do the same experiment in the earth in the moon <coughs> we launch the same object at 15.5 meter per second in the moon where the acceleration is minus 1.7 meter per second square so this means that the moon produced change in velocity of 1.7 meter per second in every second 
Uh, so it decreases the velocity in, because of the minus sign. So what are the equations in the moon? That the velocity is V0 plus AT is the equation for a motion with constant acceleration. What is Y of D? The same equation for constant acceleration that we have studied. So what it is in our case, it would be VT equal V0, 15.5, that the problem is assuming that we are launching the object 15.5, minus a, but a in this case is minus 1.7t. And y equal y0, 0, 0 plus v0, 15.5 by t, minus 1.7 divided by 2 by t squared. As I said, whatever you find this kind of problem, write the equation of motions, and the equation of motion will take you to the solution. So in this case, it's asking you, how long he will arrive up. So indeed it's not asking you how long it arrive up, uh, how long it will take to go up and down. So the time t to arrive up to the maximum height is when the velocity in the moon is zero. So I will have this equation, I will plug in v equals zero, and I will obtain the time. The time is 9.11 compared to 1.5, the difference in times is, well, 9.11, 9.11 minus 1.5. But I think that the how longer, this is how longer to go up. So 9.1 uh, minus 1.5 is um, 8, uh, 7, uh, point sixty one right seven point sixty one seconds but I think that the problem will say uh, coming back to the floor so this time will have to be multiplied by two uh, it will delay the same time to go up and to go downwards from the maximum height and the problem is done.